Jackson. And I'm Miss Hicks. We're with Character Development. And we are so excited to show you Utah Valley University. Woo! Go Wolverines! Okay, so we're gonna do the Go Wolverines, but I'm gonna show you how it is, okay? okay. So here's your Wolverine. Like this. Here's your other Wolverine. <laughs> now you're gonna cross the Wolverines. So this is a U, V, and U. Oh yeah, like this though. Okay, ready? So we're gonna say Go Wolverines, right? Go Wolverines! Go Wolverines! Go Wolverines! Go Wolverines! Woo! Woo! So tell us um, some facts about UVU, what you like about it, maybe what it's known for. Awesome, so probably my favorite thing is engaged learning. And what that means is when you're learning in a classroom, um, it's a lot of hands-on things. So you're not just reading a book or you're not just listening to your teacher talk all the time. You're actually doing what you're learning about. Um, so for example, we have our aviation program, um, which is where like pilots learn how to fly. And they're not just reading about flying, they actually get to fly planes, which is really cool. What's your major? My major is aviation. <gasps> what? Awesome! And where are you from? I'm from Seattle, Washington. Great, now tell us why you picked your major. Because um, I want to fly airplanes. So I'm going to finish my classes uh, here at UVU, and then I'll start having classes over at the airport, and all my classes will, will be at the airport and flying planes. All right, so next time we're at Delta Airlines, are we going to look for you in the cockpit? Yeah, look for me. I'll be at the airlines. Awesome. Also, we have our culinary arts, which is like our cooking school. And again, they're not just reading recipes or reading about cooking. They actually get to cook things for people, and they have a whole restaurant that they get to work at, which is awesome. And then, all right, we're here with Chef Lynn at UVU Culinary School. And so, Lynn, we wanted to ask you a couple of questions. Can you tell us a little bit about the program for culinary arts? Yes. So the culinary arts program is a two-year degree. So it's, you'll get an associate's when you graduate, and we start you off with the basics. Awesome. I know UVU is really well-renowned for their culinary arts program, and I have eaten at one of their restaurants, and it was awesome. All right, so Chef Lynn, what are you guys preparing for right now? I see a lot of busyness in your kitchen. So right now what we're preparing for is our president's scholarship ball, which is our president of the university. It's her scholarship ball. So we have a new president this year. And so we're getting ready for a dinner that's we're going to be 830 people, and it's going to be about six courses that we're going to play and serve. Now tell me where you're from. So I'm from South Jordan, Utah. I went to Harriman High School, so not too far away from here, actually. So I was born and raised in Vietnam for 10 years, and I came over in 2005. And Did you speak uh, English when you came? No, I know, like, hello, how are you? But <laughs> other than that, like, no, I have to, yeah, take ESO and all that class, too. Lehigh, Utah. Lehigh, um, Utah as well. <laughs> I'm from Saudi Arabia. Um, I'm going to major in exercise sciences. Awesome, that's cool. So I major in ballroom dance and dance education. So, yeah. I'm accounting, business management. Awesome, thank you. Community health. Business management. I'm majoring in dance education. Awesome. Yep, awesome. so I'm going to be teaching dance. So And Ryan, what made you decide to become a teacher? Well, I grew up in a dance studio. Uh, my mom uh, was a teacher, and so I started playing with my toys on the dance studio floor. And then when I was about five, I started choreographing the numbers for my mom. I said, no, you should do this, mom. You should do that. I was like five <laughs> years old. And so I love it. It kind of started at that age. Uh, but I love it. I love working with the students. I love seeing the progress. That's probably the most re rewarding thing. That. Yeah. Uh, just to see the, the students progress from the beginning of the semester to the end of the semester. And what advice would you give kids who are now in elementary school as they're like preparing for college? What advice would you give them? 
Um, to plan, meaning, um, you know, you're going to be given homework assignments and you're going to have tests you need to prepare for and the way to get A's on those is just to plan your study time and your homework time um, because if you don't plan it just the time disappears and then you're not ready for the test you don't have your homework done and then you get bad grades Ooh, the diversity i like how it's big enough but yes yeah, small enough for uh most of us seeing each other every now and then through the hallway it's not like byu or uu where you have to be outside of campus here you can be inside in the winter is you know so. so we don't have to slog through the slush. Um, I love the ballroom class. I thought you might say that. <laughs> I teach her ballroom dance here. Um, I, I just love all my classes. I'm done with my main classes. So I don't have to take math anymore. I don't have to take English. I just get to dance all day and I love it. could go back and meet yourself in elementary school what advice would you give yourself to help you get ready for college honestly I would tell myself to be kind I think that definitely helped me um, we're gonna be meeting so many people and doing so many new things and everyone's different and everyone has different stories so just being kind really helps and guess who I found an APA alum Tell me who you are. My name is Trent Sens, and I graduated from APA last year. First and foremost, keep your grades up. Just do all of your homework. I know it stinks, but do your homework, keep it up, get into good habits, and then find what you want to do in life. Like, I love to dance, so that's what I found. Find what, find what your passion is, and then pursue that when you get into college. We just found a superhero. <laughs> okay, so, okay, and are you playing a sport here? Yes ma'am, I play basketball. Basketball, what position are you? Point guard. Do you have any advice for them? Uh, yeah, it's, it's all practice. I say shoot for the stars, uh, follow your dreams, and work hard. I love that. Anything else you'd like to say? Uh, come watch a game this year. We're gonna be good. <laughs> <laughs> okay, awesome.